Shujaa's the menace of human trafficking in Nigeria. Stakeholders have identified prompt reporting of cases as key to the eradication of trafficking in persons and smuggling of migrants in Nigeria. This was a consensus arrived at during a capacity building workshop in Abuja, tagged Tokam. This next report has the details. Trafficking in persons is a business that is demand driven and it's the third most highly grossing crime globally behind drug and arms trafficking. Trafficking cases is on the rise globally and in Nigeria, despite various interventions by the government and partners to deal with the menace. One factor that has made the business thrive in Nigeria is the culture of silence around issues of sexual violence and trafficking. These are stifled efforts to curb the trend. To encourage Nigerians to speak up and report such cases, a non-governmental agency has introduced an app known as TOKAM. The TOKAM project is a clarion call to end human trafficking, gender-based violence and child abuse. The project was made to train just 20 young people in FCT and then engage them to carry out awareness. But we felt like it's important to expand the project. So we went beyond the target, expanded the project and we publicized it. We have over 200 people that applied. We selected 65 from 30 states in Nigeria to train them via Zoom and online uh, courses. It was a rigorous process because we made it clear that if you want to be trained as advocates, you have to be ready to carry out action. The essence of the training is not for you to be aware, but for you to be at the forefront of fighting human rights abuses. I'm impressed because uh, uh, DevaTop uh, uh, has uh, boosted our efforts in this regard. And if organizations and NGOs and uh, government agencies are coming out like this to support us, I believe that the days of human traffickers are numbered in, in Nigeria. I was going through some statistics and realized that 99% uh, of victims, those who are trafficked you know, for sexual exploitation, are women and children. And so we can see intersections of gender um, inequality, gender-based violence, you know, and how because of the culture of silence around issues of sexual violence, you find out that a lot of these things you know, go unreported. In fact, I must say that sometimes a, um, a whole lot of people do not even understand or recognize what trafficking is, you know, and so again, commending um, TopCam on creating that awareness. Participants at the Capacity Building Workshop are drawn from various organizations with a stake on trafficking in persons. With TOKAM, it is believed that Nigerians would make use of the app to promptly report human abuse cases. Abisola Adebayo, TV360, Abuja.